channel and hello if you're new here. Today's video is my August Primark haul. You guys know how much I love Primark and of course I went in there and didn't come out with like one thing. I came out with way more things than I needed as always. Starting with this cute little bag. I feel like this is the best one to start with because it's lots of little bits and bobs. Okay so the first thing obviously face wipes. They do come in a pack of two but I have already used one of the packets obviously. So I just get the Gently Does It ones because they're for sensitive skin and I just feel like I only ever use face wipes on my eyes anyway to remove my eye makeup. I never use them on my face so I just feel like these are the best ones because there's nothing worse than getting sore eyes. Then the next thing that I picked up is this Pink Peony Rose and Apple Room Spray. I smelt it, um, I just used like the tester in the store and it smelled amazing. Yeah, it's so fresh and like florally, florally, flowery, whatever I'm trying to say. So yeah, I just feel like this is really nice for my bedroom. Um, I love my room smelling nice, I always have candles on, but I just felt like actually this is perfect if you just want to give your room like a little bit of a fresh, clean smell. So yeah, that one was £3, which I didn't think was too bad because it's a big bottle. There is 100 mils in here, so that would last you a long time. So yeah, I really, really like that one. They also have some other scents, so if this one isn't kind of your thing, then I think they've got a van vanilla one and I think they've got a clean cotton one, if I remember rightly. Then I love these little travel minis, so I'm going on holiday. Um, actually, when this video goes up, I'll be going on holiday. So this is the Micellar Cleansing Water. I just get this in the minimal, min, min, can't speak. <laughs> I actually can't speak. So I get this in the small size because it's travel friendly. And again, I use this to cleanse my face and to remove any last bits of like stubborn eye makeup, should I say. And that was 99p, I think, bargain. I also picked up some makeup bits. So these two lipsticks, are £1.50 each and I got my makeup done not so long ago and the makeup artist used this on my lips. I love a nude lip, I always go for a nude lip. And she put it on and I had no idea what brand it was or anything and I was like, oh my god, I need that lipstick, what is it? Expecting it to be like MAC. No, it was Primark, so this is called Naked. So it's just called Naked and it's matte. It's such a nice nude colour, you just can't go wrong. And for £1.50 I thought I need to stock up. So these are going to be like my go-to day everyday ones. And then my MAC ones I can use for like nights out and things. I also picked up a lip liner for £1 that is called Toast and I feel like these two will be a nice combo together. haven't actually tried them together yet but I will let you know in one of my next videos how I got on with those. Um, but again, a pound for lip liner, like even if it's rubbish, I don't mind because I've only spent a pound on it. But I've heard good things. And I also picked up this high gloss in shade Apricot Crush. I love a glossy lip. Casey can tell already. Um, did I actually just do that? Yes, I did. Okay, um, this is more like of a corally colour and I don't normally go for those colours, but I thought that actually, when I'm away, it might be quite nice to have more of like a colourful gloss rather than just a clear kind of pinky gloss over the top of my lip gloss. So I haven't tried that one yet, but again, that one was 150. I just feel like Primark makeup is really, really upping their game. Like, there's so many people that are like, oh my god, Primark makeup for this, this, that, like brow stuff, foundation, concealer, you know I love the concealer already. But honestly, like, their makeup is like a whole new level, so you need to try it out. Okay, now we're going to go on to some clothes. Well, actually, that was a slight lie. So this is another little bag. I'm actually going to go on to some accessories first. We're going to save the clothes for last. Okay, this is giving me kind of like year six school vibes if I'm honest but I love it and I saw it I tried it on and I thought you know what I'm gonna get it so I just picked up this black headband with little mini pearls on it it was two pounds and I tried it on and I thought mmm I look a bit like a school girl again but I actually love it so I think this would be really nice just like a cute little outfit I just feel like sometimes my hair looks so dull so to put a nice headband in might give it a little bit of um detail should I say so yeah that one's really nice they've got loads of headbands in there at the moment um but this one I just thought was really really pretty I love the little pearl detail and again two pound I'm not going to complain I have been wanting some of these next items for so so long and I just never got around to ordering any online and then I saw them in Primark so I thought okay I'm going to get them so I picked up this pack of four hair clips so as you can see two are just plain gold and then the other two are pearl pearl essence is that the word basically they're these two are gold and these two have got pearls on. Um, this was £3 and I just thought again for holiday, when I'm around the pool, like clip one side of my hair back, love it. Then I also picked up these hair slides. Um, again, same kind of vibe, gold and pearl. These, were two, these ones were £2, again, really, really cheap. 
so as you can see like they're really really pretty and I just feel like they also add a bit of add a bit of detail to like an outfit um sometimes well majority of the time I wear my hair straight like this so I just feel like these will add a little bit of detail and give it more of a girly vibe okay Lauren's 90p bargains coming up here you already know what it's going to be they finally had them back in my size and I thought I need to just get another pair I stock up I swear like I live in these even in winter if it, as long as it's dry and I'm just running to the shop I'll just chuck a pair of flip flops on I just think flip flops are so comfy so these again were 90p I got them in a size medium um, and they have just restocked loads of colours so I thought I'm just going to grab them while I can I live in these on holiday um, so that's all I've really got to say about these black flip flops apart from they're a bargain okay I don't know where to start with the clothes because I actually think these clothes are going to be my staple pieces like ever from Primark now okay so the first thing that I picked up is this beautiful ribbed cream little jumper um like I say jumper it's quite thin um but that's good because obviously we're not in winter yet so this one I got in size 10 to 12 for six pounds and this would be my go-to with a pair of black jeans a nice belt or a um don't know what's going on with my lighting by the way um or a skirt and thigh boots when it's coming into autumn because I really really love this so I probably should have got two because I know that I'm going to live in it and I do always live in these kinds of tops from Primark but yeah I thought for six pounds it was really really nice and it doesn't feel too thin or anything so I'm a big fan of this one then the next thing I picked up with like a chill day in, in mind so this is just a little bit screwed up Ariana Grande kind of like jumper hoodie I got this in a size small for 12 pounds so obviously it's just got her face on it upside down um, I love the camel color and then the back which I've only just noticed actually has on it's got a list of songs on it and then this has just got the front so this would be like a really chill day for me this and a pair of jeans and some trainers just to throw on um, yes yeah, so that was £12 for that and I did get the size 10 to 12 because I like it to be a little bit baggy I probably should have gone up another size but I was in a rush to grab it then the next item that I picked up is a real basic in my wardrobe I just feel like sometimes you need a real basic item so this is very screwed up I apologize it's just a little black polka dot tee with frilly sleeves sometimes I just think these look really plain but when you pair them with like a nice outfit they actually look really classy so I got this in a size six to eight for five pounds five pounds by the way the reason I got a size six to eight is because I feel like I didn't need to get my normal size 10 to 12 um it looks like quite generous in the sizing anyway so I feel like if you are going to get this maybe go down a size um it is stretchy and it's like quite nice material so I was impressed with that one and for five pound I was like yeah just add it to my basket straight away like I know that I'll live in these so yeah I got that one and you could also like crop it if you wanted to or however you want to wear it I just think they're really cute so the next item I picked up is this really really cute shirt I got that in a size 8 for 10 pounds I love the colors it's very autumnal and I just thought I'd love to wear this with a nice roll neck underneath and a nice pair of jeans this is actually shorter at the front and longer at the bottom but like I said to you I did again go down a size in this so I got this in an 8 I feel like it was quite oversized enough already so that a 10 may have been too big on me can you can make these clothes look so nice I feel like these things are perfect in autumn and it was only 10 pounds so I just felt like it was a no-brainer and I think they've got some different colors in there in the shirts now so I need to go back in there and stock up on a few more but this color I just thought was really nice and autumnal so this I actually thought would look quite nice with the shirt I haven't actually tried it on yet so if you don't see it together in the trial you'll know that I didn't really feel the outfit together this was six pounds and I got that in a size small these kinds of tops are just so versatile because you can literally wear them with anything and I just feel like this colour would look nice with black jeans or and like a black faux fur gilet over the top. But again, also with this underneath like a shirt and then some nice jeans or something, trainers, whatever kind of vibe you're going for. I do love these kinds of tops in winter though. The sleeves have got these like gold, um, this little gold detailing on the sleeve and it's ribbed material but I did still get that in a size small. I feel like sometimes ribbed material can come up a bit tight and I don't like that feeling. So I'm hoping that these two are going to go quite nicely together. I feel like the colour... The colours do go quite nicely. I mean, I'm just getting way ahead of myself. Like, I know summer hasn't ended yet, but I'm already really excited now for, like, Christmas. And I did just say that I apologise if you hate Christmas, but I just love it. The next item I picked up is this dog tooth dress. Now, I must admit, I'm a little bit unsure about this still. So I got this in a size 8 for £10. But the reason I picked it up is because I thought it would look really nice with, like, a black roll neck underneath. So, actually, am I about to do this? Yes this kind of vibe so as you can see I've got a black roll neck on at the moment wear this over the top and you've got a really cute outfit with <laughs> I've got a hanger around my neck sorry am I actually okay I've got a coat hanger hanging out my neck but let me just let me just um but let me just say oh it's just fallen off 
Oh, Christ. Oh, okay, I'm stuck. Oh, this wasn't going to plan. Basically, this outfit with a nice roll neck and a pair of chunky boots, I feel like is a really nice outfit. You can wear it to work, you can wear it for dinner, loads of different options. So yeah, £10 size 8. Has also got some buttons down the front here. And it is a little bit stretchy, which is always good. Especially coming into winter because I don't know about you, but I eat everything in sight in winter because I'm like, oh, my body's covered up, it's fine. Anyway, on to the next one. Okay, you don't even understand how excited I am to show you this. If you pick up one item from my haul or from Primark, it needs to be this item. Like, I promise you, you will not regret it. So I saw this item in, here, in Primark. I was about to say in here. I saw this item in Primark and I bought two of them straight away because I knew that when it comes to autumn, I'm going to live in it. I love the colour, it's very much me and I just feel like I went in there yesterday, um, not for anything in particular, just to have a little browse and this had basically had like three ones left. So I was like, it's popular and you guys will see what I mean. So this is just the most gorgeous cardigan and it comes with a little belt that you tie around the middle. This with like a cream roll neck and a chunky white cream teddy coat over the top. Uh, like, that is my go-to look. So this was 13 pounds and I got that in a size small. Like I said to you, I bought two because I just know how much I'm gonna live in this. Honestly, I cannot tell you how nice these cardigans are gonna look in autumn. So it's not itchy at all, it's really soft material, but yeah, I would definitely wear this with like a nice cream roll neck underneath and oh, a really chunky teddy coat. I absolutely love it. It's got two little pockets at the front as well. But I think for me, the belt detail just really adds it. I love a chunky knit anyway, especially coming into autumn. But this is my favourite item probably so far in Primark this year. That is a bold statement to make and I just made that statement. But honestly, guys, I love it. So that's that one, aka hopefully your favourite item from this haul. You might hate it, but I just love it. And while we're on the theme of kind of like autumnal vibes, I also picked up this. So this little fleecy hoodie, oh my god, how cosy does this look? I love summer, summer is my absolute favourite time of the year, but buying these things is making me so excited for like cosy nights in and like all the like autumnal candles and like hot chocolates and marshmallows and firework night and everything, basically I'm just getting carried away. So I got this in a size small and it was 18 pounds. So they also have it in more of a camely colour. <sighs> Coat hangers are just not cooperating today. They also had it in more of a camely colour, but I just love this like blush pink and cream detail. I absolutely love it. It's so soft. Like honestly, I could fall asleep on it, but I wouldn't want it because it'd be orange after my face has been on it. But anyway, yeah, it's really cute. It's got a little hood. So I feel like this is going to keep me really cosy. And there is also little pockets at the front to keep your hands warm, basically. Okay, and last but not least, an item that I have never seen in Primark before, and actually, I say an item, a set, should I say, that I've never seen in Primark before. And when I saw it, I was like, no. I was like, I literally stopped what I was doing. I was like, mum, look at this. So this is a white, I say white, it's kind of creamy white tracksuit. I can't believe it's from Primark. So let me get the hoodie. So here is the hoodie. Absolutely love this detail down here. It's got a little hood, obviously. And this I got in a size small for £12. I'm thinking this is either going to be my airport outfit or it's just going to be one that I live in every single bloody day, basically. So like I said to you, I got that top in a size 10 to 12 for £12 because I don't like them to be baggy. But wait for it. Oh my God, can we just look at these joggers? How insane are they? They go in at the bottom, which is my absolute favourite cuffed ankle. They've got pockets around here. Honestly, I'm obsessed. So these ones I got in a size 6 to 8 for £10. I've got myself a new white tracksuit that I'm absolutely going to live in. And that tracksuit with a teddy coat over the top, my absolute dream combo and chunky trainers. Yes, absolutely love it. So I'm not going to lie, I think those two are going to be a big win for me. Um, <laughs> I'm going to be living in it basically. So as you guys can see, I picked up quite a few things. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you in my next video.